Hello everybody, welcome back to another Photoshop tutorial. And this one gonna show you how to get rid of a pre-applied filter to a photo or image. What am I talking about here? Here's the original image, and then I've applied a filter. In this case, a deep emerald green filter. And I've got it at a pretty strong percentage. How would I, if I got this picture and I was working on a website, for example, and I wanted to get rid of the green filter and get back to the original image, and I did not have a layered document, here's how you can do it using just Photoshop. Let me show you. So here's an example now of what that uh, image looks like. Now I'm going to remove the filter. Let's go up. What do you want to do is you want to go to your filter, and then you want to go to Camera Raw Filter. When you do that, you're going to get a few options. Go to Basic, and then grab this little eyedropper tool. And here's where the technique is that you, not a lot of people know about. Click on that eyedropper, and you assume that you can just start getting rid of white stuff. But what you can actually do is you can select the entire the entire picture, for example. It actually becomes a selection tool or a modify tool, even though you would never know that. Do that, and now look what's happened. It's removed the white balance automatically. And you can see it here. It's changed the white balance, pardon me, to remove the tint and adjust the temperature. Now, I don't think it quite went quite far enough, so I would add in a little more yellow, and I might just change it a little bit here. If I click on OK, for example, there we go. Here's now the filter removed. Here's the original shot right there. Filter removed. It's very, very similar. You can add in some small adjustments to get there, but that's how you do it using basically one click. Thanks for watching.